Hello, Vamos Kirchen. Very happy to be here playing for you uh, from, well, from here, from Switzerland, from the French part of Switzerland, a town called Valère sur Ursin, which is on the lake of Neukirchen, near the lake of Neukirchen, about 20 minutes from, from Lausanne and about seven hours from you. So, since we're not going to be meeting in person this year, I thought I'd do a little virtual playing for you. Hope you enjoy it. Okay, so here's what I'm thinking for this, for our concert together. Uh, I have set myself up a, a framework, and the framework is, is just one take, one time, just like a real concert. So whatever happens, happens. If my dog comes in and wants to go for a walk, 
that's it. If the phone rings uh, because there's a fire, and I'm supposed to go because I'm a fireman in, in our village, I'm one of the... In fact, in our village, I am the only fireman. But uh, then, well, in that case, I will have to go and I'll have to come back. But that's basically the only thing. Because I want to feel the same way I, in a concert, that it's just this one moment, as, as every concert is, it's just one moment in time. Even if uh, I might play Take Five, like, like just now, uh, it'll be different every time. Uh, yeah, all right. In this concert, I, I, I decided I was going to play some of the things I like to pl always play in concerts, like Take Five. Take Five for me is a, is a piece that's really useful in these kinds of situations, to, as a way to get to know each other, and because it's a very famous jazz piece, and I think it's fun to play in the harp, and I like it. Another piece that I like to play uh, is a piece, especially because now we're in Switzerland, somehow, uh, a piece that I wrote for my wife uh, many years ago, when we first met, and it's called Swiss Miss. <laughs>
So I, I mentioned that, uh, that I'm the only fireman in our village, although of course I'm one of, of a whole group that takes care of a bunch of these villages around. Uh, but one of, and this was always my, my dream, I mean, I've, I've been a harp player since I was seven, and this was really the path that my life took me, and I'm, I'm very happy and grateful that this happened. At the same time, uh, I, I always had this fascination with being a fireman. I mean, if, if you look at photos of me in, in Halloween, I was often a fireman, and there are many photos of me playing and being a fireman as a kid. And it turns out that here in Switzerland, you can be in the volunteer. I think it may be the same thing in, in Vermelskirchen. I don't know. I'll find out when I get there. Uh, anyway, because of this uh, mixed skill set of you know, being interested in, in fire fighting and also being a harp player, it just so turns out that I got to write the theme song, the, the official march for, the, for our fire department. And, yeah, I, I like to play it in concert because, because there aren't, actually there aren't that many fires here. And so I never get a chance to play it. So I'll play it for you now. Um, it's actually nice to play it for uh, a German-speaking audience because it has a fantastic musical joke hidden in it. Um, the name of the fire department, of the, over the, over, it's, it's called SDIS, which is S-D-I-S. The service for defense uh, contre l'incendie against fires uh, and secours, helping, you know, rescuing. Uh, Estis, I mean, we just say Estis. But as you may know, in the you know, there's in the solfège we have in the French solfège is do ré mi fa sol la si do. But you have, of course, a different way of na naming notes: uh, cis and s and fis and os and so on. And so uh, and as Bach did, as many composers have done, I took uh, the word for S, which is this note, and this, which is this note. Actually, it's the same pitch, it just has two different names. So it's not, okay, may, maybe it's not that hilarious of a joke. So many jokes are relative. Anyway, the theme to this song about the fire department, the, the, uh, the march, has that as its theme, S dis. Here we go. Thank you. 
let's go. One of my, I mean, every musician has the story of what they did during the pandemic, which of course, <laughs> what they're doing still. Um, one of the things that I did was I wrote some music with a friend of mine in London. We'd sent tracks back and forth and recorded them. Uh, and this is, I want to play one or two of those pieces from, from the album, which is called Harp Mispheres. You can hear it on Spotify uh, or buy it on iTunes. But uh, this one is called The Cyclic Maze. And this is a, a condensed one version, uh, one harp version of it. about a, a bossa nova. Here in Switzerland right now, it's in the afternoon. On a, it turns out it's a Saturday. Maybe you'll be watching this on a Saturday. I haven't done any of the, of the math required to look at a calendar and figure it out, but I think on an afternoon in April. Yeah, how about this? This is uh, how insensitive.
What's next? Oh, I'd like to do another song uh, from this from this album. Uh, yeah, this is a song which is now it has a different name now. We got we got a we were lucky to get a, a deal with a, a label and they released it, uh, but some of the names got changed in the process. Now it's called the poetry of the past. But I always think of this song as being called that many days plus one. And I guess for me this song is really a a song of this time, just as that album was a, an album of of the pandemic of these everything that was going on this is a song every you know that many days plus one that that really came out of this experience I'm going to play one more piece for you. This is a piece uh, that I always like to end my concerts with. And so even virtual concerts, even bizarre virtual concerts, uh, I like this piece for different reasons because it's a famous jazz standard. Yeah, Maybe more than that because I like it and I play what I like. Uh, because otherwise that would be crazy if I didn't play what I like. I mean, I'm the only one up here. But what I really like about this piece, besides being a, 
famous jazz standard and a piece that I just like. I like it that the name of this piece is also the name of a kind of car that's really useful for moving harps, even though today I didn't have to move a harp. So this is uh, Caravan by Duke Ellington and Juan Tizol. And uh, I want to thank you for, for listening. Uh, thanks to everyone at the in Vermel Kirchen, at the, at the venue, at the, the club. And I hope to see you in, in, in person very soon. Uh, so keep safe and be well. And we'll talk, you know, we'll talk over a beer on the, on the terrace that I've heard about. Here we go, caravan.
see you very soon.